Here we go again. Seven Days to Die, Alpha 17.3. We're back at our base after our wonderful horde night. <laughs> Cowering at the top of Higachi Pharmaceuticals. Um, as soon as we got back, we started making ourselves a shotgun. And quickly realized that the whole time we were in Higachi Pharmaceuticals, at least I think the whole time, uh, we were wearing our nerdy glasses instead of our lucky looter goggles. So yeah, big fail there when you're after beakers. Uh, also queued up some cement plates to make our little uh, drop bridge uh, not floaty. So they're drying. Uh, added a couple in the front there just to kind of complete at least the, the facade of the base and uh, yeah we're going south today we haven't been south there's a couple roads here though so or are we gonna go after the buried supplies buried supplies are northwest like a kilometer northwest Northwest, not northeast, buddy. Nah, that looks like it's just in the middle of nothing. We're going south. See what we can see. Grab what we can. Uh, not that we're low on them. But could use some more glass jars just so we can finish making our glue. Uh, glue is duct tape. Duct tape is, you know, mods and guns. So we're going to start needing more and more of that. Get in here. That guy's feral. Take out the cowboy before he gets back up. Ooh, dogs. Wolf. Away. <sighs> Don't like wolves. At least they give me a nice warning. How's that go again? Good thing we uh, broke that unlocked door. Yeah, cat food and a hidden backpack. Bye. Mr. Glowy Eyes. Alright. We are supposed to come in there. So, I see you up there. Yeah, you're gonna headbang. Okay. Grab this trash pile. Oh, headbang and stop. We got a bunch of skill points from our pharmaceutical run. Our Higachi pharmaceutical run. Go ahead. Use some of them. We still got our run and gun magazine. So, after we left Higachi Farm Skittles, ran over the trader, sold everything we could, grabbed all our stuff out of the forge. Uh, there was nothing left in the cement mixer. Came back. We threw our iron into the forge. And here we are. So we did grab healing factor. Uh, what to grab? What to grab? So we need seven. And since we're wearing all heavy armor, might as well. I'm going to do it sooner or later. Probably should grab some, some just, uh, was it agility? Yeah, agility next for, um, more base stamina. Once we get that to like, I don't know, 160 base stamina and 
or a level six flashlight, and and get some uh, some ranks in heavy metal, we could swap over the sledge, make some of these encounters a lot easier. Did I hit you in your armor head? Okay, head. These friggin' trees are just gigantic, and they clip through all sorts of stuff. find it exceptionally annoying when you're inside a house and you got the tree clipping through. Nobody in there? Okay. Somebody's downstairs now. Grab all this stuff. There's some military armor. Don't hear them beating on anything, so that means they're coming up to see me. Another anvil. Ugh, fail. Come on. You can do it. Ah, screw it. Nope, missed. Hit him in the shoulder. Get out of here. Oh my lord. Um, that's a bear. Can we do one of these numbers? Oh, click. Wow, that was close. Easy way to take out a bear. We have any bones? We do. We'll craft a bone knife just for Mr. Bear. Oh, it's already half durability? What the hell? Yeah, yeah, that was so worth it. Waste of time. Where's my bike? Other side of the building. We're gonna make it really far south, huh? One building. It's already like two o'clock. Oh yeah, we made it back to where we spawned. We're really adventurous so far. What do we got over here? Big houses. Did we loot this place? Have we been this far south? No, we haven't. Okay. I'm just going to pick up the bike because I don't feel like coming back and looking for it. Is this one of the drop rooms? Don't remember. We used a lot of shotgun shells in uh, the pharmaceutical building. After looking at my stockpile, when we went in, we were 250. When we come out, we'd use over 100 rounds. I picked up a few back at the uh, base. Sideways cupboards, eh? Let's go upstairs. Uh, that is the roundy round place. And that's a fall. I remember that. Yep. A framed up bathroom. This is what we're after. Aw. Brain alcohol and a splint. I'm glad they don't use this more often. Just 
kind of conjures bad images. So I'm not sure where they all are, but they're quite angry and loud. Give me your ankles. Chilling on people's heads. That seems to be way more common in 17.3. Knocking each other down. That's most of them, but I still hear somebody downstairs. Do one of those. Oh, hello. Right in my face, huh? Close the hatch. Yeah, he's just chilling, beating on the block up there. Seems like they're getting a little confused on their pathfinding sometimes. I cannot tell where they are. I think they're underneath me. Get up here and grab the good stuff. Oh. Okay. Somebody found some landmines. There's an SMG. Our first of this playthrough. Normally by this point, I have so much 9mm that I consider the SMG very viable. Currently, no, not so much. We'll see if we can sell that hunting rifle, since it is a level 6. That's all we can scrap for now. Let's see about getting out of here. Wow, they're just so angry. Is this a wandering horde? Or did you ladies come from inside? We could always cheat and look. Oh, hello! They're just everywhere. This looks like a wandering horde because it's the same, same zombies. Oh, come on, frames. You can do it. CPU is just cooking, probably. Out of stamina. Oh, thought you were dead. Let's cheat and see if that was a wandering horde. No? That was a lot of zombies in that building, man. Maybe that's all of them. Let's go peek. See what's in the basement. I think there's a basement. We didn't find the kitchen either, so... See what else we could scrap. Don't need a rank one machete. Kill some football players. The cheerleaders must be pissed off at them. More junk to scrap. Nice, another aloe seed. Do currently have one living off the land magazine. So if we get enough 
whatevers. We can make some seeds. And never worry about touching another bird's nest again. Ever. Well, maybe if we actually find like steel arrowheads, we tag a bird's nest and just make the arrows as we go. Do have a mod installed called Magbo. That thing is amazing, but it's a little too amazing. Has a 10 round clip as a repeating crossbow. Ugh, had to hit me. Make me bleed. 10 round clip's a little bit of overkill considering its damage is uh, about the same as the hunting rifle. Very nice to use though. Very fun. Kind of a little overpowered. If you do like your stealth gameplay, I would highly recommend it though. It takes like 60 military fiber and forged steel and I have no idea what perk it's locked behind. One of the uh, quite higher end ones, probably advanced, advanced engineering. That's what all the weapons are behind. Lock on. That's a very nice in game model, too. Yeah. Nice little icon. Really pretty model. But when you can pretty much machine gun off uh, crossbow bolts, it's a little, a little crazy. Actually, one more sec. Base damage is 44. It's pretty good. And I have, what, three? Three in perception? So I'm not increasing it a whole bunch. 10%. So it's got a base damage of 40. And magazine extender also works with it, so you can end up with a 15 round clip repeating crossbow. That's just unrealistic. I think if the clip was reduced probably be kind of balanced. I mean really reduced. Maybe down to three and magazine extender gives it one more. Gotta scrap some stuff and fill up our queue again. How much is this stuff? Not very much. Okay. Good enough for now. Moving on. I think all the good stuff was in the uh, in the attic there. Oh, you're feral! Yay! Oh, I was just about to say, yay! We didn't get hit for once. Thanks, buddy. Well, with the paint on, it's the heavy armor perks and the healing factor. Should pop back up in health pretty quick. Somebody up there. Sounded like you're right on top of me. You must be at the stairs here. Oh, those are the iron crossbow bolts that I fired into the stairs. 
And this is the garage. And this is the perfect angle to assault the garage from if it's full of people. Any of these cabinets even lootable? No. Anything up here? No. There's an open garage door right over here. Zombies. Super smirt. we can get into or maybe we just run home like like we should <laughs> nah let's go see what else we got is that the same exact house no yeah why not Grab a gas barrel. Maybe wrench the car, because we desperately low on oil. Another wolf? Apparently this is his car. He didn't like that. Yes, I know, Thunder. Somebody's angry. Ah, uh, you're buying the fence. You can wait. I'll be with you shortly. Now you want to use the door? Arlene, you're such a moron. Since you're supposed to go in through the basement, we don't like fighting in a basement. We'll go in through here and just head upstairs. So if the entrance is the uh, basement, then, uh, ow. Loot is most likely on the top floor. Steel armor and iron armor. That steel glove might actually be an upgrade for us. Well, that's the basement. Bookshelf with a look like a reinforced padding. That's for light armor. That is not what we want. We want some steel plates. Kinda in the basement. You know, it's not really good to build stairs without a some kind of subfloor. That's just not up to code. Somebody beating on something metal up here. That's a few of them.
the old shotgun get you out of a lot of trouble go oh, I'm stuck I'm bleeding might not get out of this one oh don't panic just run three cops huh <laughs> wow all right let's reload and fix these assholes well then have we had enough adventure for today I think I have come on hate those to oh that's a rank four machete I hate those little bags on top of something where you can't really get an angle to grab them yeah I know there's a shit ton of you jerks in there hoodie boy looks like he's feral and we're out of stamina. Go on to the shotgun. Getting a little tight on time now. Should be able to finish up this place. God, it's ladies' night. Everybody dead? Just about. Hey, they even cut me a hole in the uh, side of the house, so I don't have to cut one out myself. Medical pile. Some more vitamins. Go ahead and use one of them. There is a whole bunch of anger down there. We want nothing to do with it. Bounce, bounce. Come on, drop it. There we go. Hey. That's a rock. Head back home. Man, those cops. Getting stuck in there and then having the one start going into heart pound mode. Bit scurry. Bit scurry. No, sir. I'm, I'm in a rush, kind of. See what we can do about dumping off whatever junk we have. Refuel. Pick her up. Hatchivator to the top. It's a little discombobulating. Turn you off. You can see we made some buckshot and bull casing. Well, you're empty, but... Oh, you're double empty. Okay, so we made all our cement. Oh, shut them for now. Got some glue. Do a little bit of this. Gunpowder. We went and made all our gunpowder, so we're... We have, we're out of coal, basically. But we're going to use that buckshot and just make a bunch of shotgun rounds. Mm, should I keep it to sell? No steel gloves are not an upgrade, but they're sellable. Dump all this sell stuff in here. Yeah, sure, why not? Might hang on to the machete. Yeah, who am I kidding? Get rid of 
this junk. We have enough anvils now. Unless we make yet another one. We'll hang on to the claw hammer. Just cause. So we got a spare claw hammer, spare wrench. We already have a paintbrush. Uh, starting to get a collection of various other ammos. We got a bunch of magnum rounds, more than you usually have about about this time. I don't have magnum. Can't make a magnum. So yeah. Doesn't really help us. And it's go time. Let's get our bow out. And oh, we're carrying on Molotovs. I'll deal with the rest of that stupid inventory in a moment. Oh, please stop beating on stuff. We're going to do what we did the other night to save ammo. I just kind of creep over here and hope for no vultures and cops. Now I believe the dogs will be able to run over without dropping. Nope. And we just bang that concrete for no reason. I'm just swinging and missing and missing. We get a kill. Yep. Got our stamina back. Wobbly head. We got wolves, a room for cops. Interesting two houses. Didn't really get much out of them, but. I'll try and progress a little bit farther south. Maybe find another trader would be nice. Doggo. Knocking down Miss Bad Hair Day. Oop. That hurt. Well, we'll leave it here. We'll keep the recording running just in case anything actually interesting happens. But if you watch this, and all of this, thanks for watching.